rain formation, and the water cycle. Have you ever wondered, where the rain comes from? Rain is very important, for the survival of humans, plants, and animals. It brings fresh water, to the Earth's surface. Water can be in the atmosphere, on land, in the ocean, and even underground. It gets used, over and over again, through what is called, the water cycle. The sun provides the energy, that drives, the whole water cycle. At the beginning, of the cycle, sunlight heats up water, on Earth. The heat causes, the water to turn into water vapor, and rises into the air. The process of changing water into water vapor, is called, evaporation. On their way up, the air around the water particles, grows colder and colder. As the water vapor cools, it turns back into water, in the form of tiny droplets. This process of, changing water vapor, into water droplets, is called, condensation. Large numbers of these droplets, form clouds. Wind takes the clouds, from one place to other. In a cloud, droplets come together, with other droplets, to form larger drops of water. When the droplets become too heavy, to stay in the cloud, they fall to the ground, as rain, due to the force of gravity. Rain falls from clouds in the sky, in the form of water droplets, is called, precipitation. Water can also fall from the sky, in the form of hail, sleet, or snow. When it rains, some water soaks, into the ground, and some of it, collects, forming streams, and rivers, that eventually flow into the sea. The water cycle begins again. Evaporation, condensation, and precipitation. Through this cycle, water is distributed, around the world. 